Hey everybody, Joe here, and today we're going to be answering the question, how can I determine my camera's quality before I buy? We have three different models here, all fixed lens of 2 megapixel, 4 megapixel, and 8 megapixel. We're going to show you a video of cycling through all of those resolutions now, but before we get started, we have some information we wanted to talk about. Some important information regarding this video. Firstly, know that our goal is to show you multiple different resolution options we have available for these cameras. In order to take full advantage of this and really get an idea of what we're trying to show you, you're going to have to view this video on a 4K capable screen. And you're going to have to set the YouTube quality on the video to 4K in order to get the full image. Additionally, 4K cameras are limited to 15 frames per second. Our entire video, even when the shots are not in 4K, are filmed in 15 frames per second because we only wanted you to see the difference in resolution and not be distracted by any other changes in the image. With all that out of the way, let's get started by showing you what 720p looks like. Alrighty, so as you can see, we're starting out with 720p. Probably look a little bit fuzzy right now. That's because most of the videos you're likely used to watching nowadays are filmed in 2 megapixels or 1080p. 720p, or standard HD, is considered essentially an obsolete resolution. We're not really selling any new cameras that can do 720p, and actually to even hit the resolution, we had to downstep our 2 megapixel camera, or 1080p camera, down to 1 megapixel just to show you. We're going to up it to the full 2 megapixels or 1080p right now. Let's take a look. Awesome, so you should instantly see a pretty significant jump in quality as we have doubled our resolution from 1 to 2 megapixels. Currently, in the field, 1080p or 2 megapixels is the most common standard you'll see on cameras across both IP and coax. However, we like to think that 4 megapixels, the next step up, is the nice sweet spot between sharpness, image quality, frames per second, and the amount of storage space that you'll receive. We're going to take a look at 4 megapixels right now, also known as 1440p. From this moment on, you won't be able to see a major image quality difference unless you're viewing this video on a 4K display. Let's take a look. 1440p, also known as 4 megapixels again, is the sweet spot between resolution sharpness, hard drive space, and image quality. There is another step above this, however, and if you have a 4K display and are looking to absolutely maximize the amount of image quality you can get from cameras today, you might want to try or consider using 4K cameras also known as 8 megapixels. These cameras can max out at 15 frames per second and will consume a larger portion of hard drive space as compared to 4 megapixels or 1080p. However, with the advent of H.265 hardware and software video encoding, you should be able to make up for some of that storage space loss. Let's take a look at 4K or 8 megapixels right now. Awesome, 4K, also known as 8 megapixels. We're working at 8 million pixels per frame of image quality here, which means there's a lot of data being consumed, but the trade-off is, again, if you're on a 4K display, you should see an incredibly significant jump in image quality. You'd even be able to digitally zoom in on this image a little bit without losing some of that detail. That's exactly how sharp this is. However, for any of these cameras, if you're interested in any kind of purchases or an upgrade, we always recommend that you speak to one of our sales pros to ensure that the camera you're looking at will be compatible with your current NVR or DVR. Real quick, before we close out today, we wanted to cycle through these resolutions one more time just to show you back to back the image quality jump you'll see, starting with 720p. So we're going to go back to 720p now. One megapixel, two megapixel, four megapixel, eight megapixel. Thanks for joining us today as we showed you how to determine camera quality based on the resolution of your camera. For any information about these products, their compatibility or availability, give our sales pros a call today at 561-288-5258. And until next time, stay safe.